what's up sexy sam Linda squad we're looking at the new and potentially improved version of persephone and i did just play a video with her um but i was muted the entire time because i'm an actual idiot so we're back and it's going to be even better this time because i actually know what the hell i'm doing which is going to be great so um let's just start off with one of each ability so i can go through it so the one it's just a straight line it's literally like a like a thicker thanatos scythe and it doesn't have lag anymore so it goes exactly where you're aiming right when you shoot it and it leaves um a spot where where it should have one i guess is the right way to say that it leaves a, a minion where it hits like it hit the wall over there so there's there's a minion there it also does not hit multiple people anymore it only hits the one um it goes through minions but it doesn't hit multiple gods so that's that two is in my opinion the coolest change because the two used to just be you'd place a bunch of seeds and it was super like yeah whatever dude okay yeah no like crazy crazy psycho man's talking to me again but the two is now cool so you see these kind of like fog characters that i'm placing down okay i guess i'm just dead kind of freaked up bro but these kind of like fog um new moving things it now does damage in that area so like the the seeds don't move anywhere instead they just do damage where they hit okay as you can see it's pretty nice her clear does suffer a little bit it looks like but then again your three does damage now so not that bad so I mean that's pretty much the, the whole thing of her rework as of right now um it's not the most insane rework her one is pretty much the same except it stops at the first god hit and it's a little bit you know closer i guess um her two is really really good it gives you a heal it does an explosion when you place it down and the flowers bite pretty hard so yeah it's pretty much what that is i don't know why am i not getting a heal right now though they're supposed to heal you she can activate when the skulls are activated she restores health oh okay so it's healed when i do this and i activate the skulls i just get a heal back all right that makes sense but it's still really strong um it does feel like it should stun but that would be way too overpowered so i'm glad it doesn't and then the three is literally the exact same thing only now it does damage which i don't think it did before but i could be wrong maybe it did do some damage before um and the alt is the same thing except for the fact that it no longer pulls you closer you know you know before how you would get stuck in like a certain circumference around wherever you get vine snapped to uh now it's just anywhere in the alt anywhere in the alt is considered i guess duck i mean it doesn't really make that much sense but it's better oh that was a big mistake bud boom it did not stick him yeah i mean that that's that's pretty much the whole advantage right there that i just showed off of the new one is that you can aim it so precisely that it's it seems i mean it's definitely not hard to miss but it's harder to miss it's and it's a lot more controlled and and reactive to what you actually want to do which makes it really nice to use 
Oh, also the passive, right? I haven't died, so <laughs> I haven't showed off the passive. I don't know what the fuck the passive does. I'm just going to be completely honest. Um, it says... It says... That... You can place seeds down when you're dead. And you, you, you can't do damage like you used to be able to anymore. Um, but... I don't know how to use the seeds that it places down. Oh my god, I do so much damage though. Oh my god. Send all those boys out. Could also just kill him probably. Oh god. Oh god. Here we go. Nice. So what killed him was I think the the flowers running towards him, yeah. So I hit him with the two and the flowers running towards him did 340. So nice. So much damage. <clears throat> I think she's gonna be much better than she was. And I you know, I don't claim to know anything about Persephone in general because I was never good with Persephone. Uh, but just the fact that I can be good with her now, I can hit all my abilities and I can confirm damage and it's so much more simple for the average folk like me. Um, I think that's, that's huge. Makes her very good. I still don't think this goes through walls, but I'm going to check. Doesn't go through walls. Okay. Used to go through walls. Doesn't anymore. These, however, this does go through walls. So you could throw your, your seeds through walls now. You can also use your seeds like I just did there. You want to plant one down there and just use them to clear wave and use your one for poke. Oh, I think he stepped in my two. Did he step in my two? Yeah, my two killed him. <laughs> yeah, dude. I mean, it's like you can be so much more aggressive and there's so much less wait time to it. You know, like before you'd be like, okay, used all my abilities. Now I got to wait for them to grow and then finally do some damage and then come back to them 13 minutes later. Oh, yeah, I, I planted that seed there. I was ready for you. Haha. <laughs> No, now it's just like boom, seed, damage, boom, seed, damage, boom, seed, damage, boom, combo, damage, boom. It's so much more proactive. And it's so good. It really is. Um, Like I said, I'll talk about the passive one more time. I don't understand it at all. But apparently when you die, uh, you can't do damage or use abilities or anything but instead you can click like an auto attack and plant a seed down up to six of them um and then after your seeds have been placed you can or when you spawn they then blossom and you can pop them like you know just like a normal flower seed i think that's what it's like um, but again, I haven't been able to do it successfully. And every time I click when I'm in my passive, it just cancels my passive and I die. So, um, could be user error. I never claim to be the smartest. Could be user error. Could also be bugged, literally. So I'm not sure. But what I do know is that even with her not really having a passive anymore other than gold, uh, she feels so much stronger. So much stronger. Execute. 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 
Look at that damage, dude. What in the hell? Oh, I'm so dead. Oh, I'm so dead. Okay, so now I can click and place these seeds down. I can place six and they will be blossomed and ready for me. And you have all the time in the world to run. Like I could just be like, boop, 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 you know? And then you can just cancel it whenever you want. And yes, um, while you're in your death, your, your cooldown or your death timer does go down. So you don't have to worry about your death timer being extra long or anything. But you have your entire death timer. Go around the, um, go around the, the map and place down seeds. So it's pretty nice actually for setup. Like let's say you die and you know, your team's going to want to fight at gold. You just go to gold and play some flowey boys. Okay. See, the worst part about being me is that when something is super cool and then you miss everything, it looks like it's not super cool, but trust me, it is. Trust me, it actually is. Just miss everything because I'm not the greatest. Good damage, though. Throw these boys out towards the wave to clear. They don't actually travel that far, so it didn't clear, but that's okay. I'm going to use my two, plant the seeds. Also pull the, the buff. Send my seeds that way to blow up. And get the red. Nice. Um, Fear the Magus has 12% life steal now. <clears throat> which is really nice. Obviously, he also bought Spear the Magus because it has life steal. And he's going into more life steal, so that's cool. I'm gonna get divine. Yeah, you can see like actually how much damage I'm doing. I have 479 power. The one is almost 100% scaling. It's like 90% scaling. The two is like a ridiculous amount of scaling, and the three is a ridiculous amount of scaling, and the alt is a ridiculous amount of scaling. So, no matter what you do, you have a ton of damage, and the fact that just every ability does damage makes it so nice. Makes it so nice, man. Did he die? Did he go what? Oh, he didn't die. I guess you just like everything goes invisible and you can't even see anything. That's kind of crazy. I that's so weird. I do need cooldown though. I'm gonna go Genji's here. Taking a lot of damage. A lot of damage. A lot of damage. Hmm. Your middle tower has been destroyed. You can't escape the future. Initiate construction. Terminate them. Okay, I'm pretty sure. I mean, he's just doing a bunch of damage to me right now because I have no defense and he does have defense. I mean, look at that, though. <gasps> the two does damage to the Phoenix.
Oh my god. Why? What the f What in the actual hell? Why does the two do damage to the Phoenix? Oh my god, my the things just ate him. Okay, let me just I just need to make sure one more time. Hold on. Yeah, no, it works. Okay. That hits Phoenix. Hmm. Does this hit Phoenix? No. This hits Phoenix. Okay. Uh, I hope that's a bug. That did 370 damage. Yeah, I, I'm going to go ahead and say, I hope that's a bug because if it's not, I'm in, I'm in deep, deep agony about this. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm just throwing these boys. Like I said, the minions go through walls. Don't know why. Back. Yeah, okay. You got it. He got his back off. Jeez, dude. I I'm still mind blown at the fact that this hits. This hits. Why do hit? Why do hit? And why does it hit objectives, bro? Does it hit your own? No. Oh, dude, I am just. I'm in shambles. I am in shambles. I'm about to just chuck a fucking alt at him. Honestly, we're going to Missed. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, what? You know what it reminds me of? The thing doing damage to uh to objectives. Is an old, 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 like way back when, old Nua. What if I just like blink and like sent them all towards you? No? Doesn't work like that? Just grabbing some heals. You know what it is. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Oh. Like, the damage output that I do with these things is ridiculous. They 
thought maybe it would kill him. Okay. Just grabbing some heals real quick. You know how it goes. You know how it goes. Both got the pendulum of time. Ouch. Kind of rude if you ask me, but whatever. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Dude, my two hit him twice. Like two plants, and then my two actually detonated on him twice. For literally 1,500 damage. Look at this. My one hit him once for 540. My god. Did you see how much damage that did? To the Titan just now. That did like... That did... What? Oh, god. Jeez, bro. God, jeez. Four plants did 930 damage. Oh my god. It's like, well, uh, why do you do that much damage? Why do you do that much damage? I think she's nuts. I think she's nuts. That's, that's my take. As somebody who... Even he said that's a lot of damage. And I'm not in... I'm not in Discord with him. I'm not, I'm not in Discord with him. Even he said that's a lot of damage. Um, but yeah, it, it's so much more confirmable, so much more power, so much more burst, so much more like sustained power during fights. It's so good. I think the rework. I mean, it takes some of her uniqueness away, being able to plant twenty McGee boys out there. But I, I don't know, man. It's just too good. It's too good. I love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this first look video and me kind of goo goo ga gagging over all the damage and the the cool healing and whatnot but just i i just think it's great um hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to like comment and subscribe until next time guys peace